Mimi, the glad scientist, but as you know, I love reading. So today we're going to be reviewing this book called One Crazy Summer by Rita Williams Garcia. It's about three girls, well, I should say three sisters, visiting their mom in Oakland, California because their parents are divorced. And The rest is history. So let's talk more about the book. I made this worksheet called The One Crazy Summer Review. And the older Imani geniuses can feel this out. But right now we're going to discuss it. So who are the characters? Let's start with the sisters. Their names were Delphine, Vanetta, and Fern. And then their grandmother, they call their grandmother Big Mom. And her, obviously the dad and the mom was in there. <laughs> and also the Black Panthers. What happened in the story? Hmm, hmm, hmm. <laughs> what happened was they visited their mom in Oakland, California. And their mom wasn't a very nice person. She wanted them out of the house because she was used to living alone. And they decided to go to the Black Panthers breakfast program that they put together for children in, the, in 1968. That's the exact year. And so they went there and they talked about Huey Newton and Bobby Seal, the founders of the Black Panther program, breakfast program. And then they, at the end of their summer, they uh, went into, they were helping protest with the Black Panthers. They were gonna protest with the Black Panthers and the book will tell you more about that if you read it. <laughs> and when was it? 1968. Where did it take place? It took place in the mother's house and at the Black Panther, mostly the Black Panther breakfast program. And why did it happen? Because uh, they went there because their mom didn't want them there, obviously. So they just decided to go on, on an adventure. And that's it for today. Mm -hmm. Well, here's a bonus question that I did write on the worksheet. <laughs> what do you think about the book, if you're going to read it, or about what we've discussed today? And I think this, I'm not very comfortable talking about this time because it's uh, segregation, all that stuff. Martin Luther King died, got in Jibbing, protesting. I don't want to go down the list. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm not very comfortable talking about this. You may have different feelings, but the truth must be known. So, <laughs> this, other than that, that, this was a really good book for me. And it will be a really good book for kids my age, like 9 and up, or 7 and up. And I hope you guys enjoy this book when you read it. Bye-bye!